Oh no, no more dog animals. Damn it. Oh, I wish I had a block. For now, all I can do is smack the shit out of them. Yeah! Damn it. It hit me as I was pressing X, and that just cancels my entire animation. Yeah, we have another, like, sacrifice-looking area. Ooh, heals. I'm a fan. I like- I like having, uh, life, not being dead. So we're gonna keep going up. Maybe shoot the dog things before they hit us. Is there anywhere I can explore over here? I'm just gonna have to, like, rub myself on areas that look like they go further. Because there are obviously secrets abound. Oh. Well, that's helpful. <laughs> There's an even further map. Oh, mm, I still have no idea what's going on. I'm not even gonna try and pretend. Hey, buddy! You... No, 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 no. Whatever it is you think you were gonna try to accomplish, you're not allowed. He looked like he had, like, a hoodie. I thought he was doing a little training montage. But I guess they're like mages. They shoot lasers through walls. Ow. Ow. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Good to know. Good to know. Let's try this again. The secret to life is smack things down as soon as you see them, not even a question it. Ooh, killing one of those enemies gave me currency. Thank you, enemies. That's really kind of you, honestly. So if I follow this through, now on the map we'll be fucking outside again. What? Where are we? What are we doing? <laughs> this map makes no actual sense. Like, we went up, but the, according to this map, it goes, like, left and right. Maybe that's how I should be thinking of it. Like, if we turn this map sideways, if you flipped it a little bit, then it makes more sense. Okay. And so really, it's just showing me underlying cave areas. And the fact that they go further- Oh! Oh my god! Jesus! Help! God! There were so many! Okay, this is kind of awkward. There's a currency thing there! I can't get it! Okay, we're just gonna let ourselves die. Because that's gonna reset the area, that's gonna reset all these enemies. And that means I can get the currency from their bodies. <laughs> there were so fucking many, dude, holy shit. I don't have, like, ultra attacks just yet. I just have stab, stabby, stab. Dash. Stab, stabby, stab. Oh, no, right, those, those, those are perilous. The currency. So now that I have all four of those, oh, oh God! All right. So you have to find four individual pips, and then they form one piece of currency once you've gotten all four of those pips. This is gonna be a long one. This is gonna be the long haul kind of game. <laughs> I thought I was getting, like, I, mean, I thought I was basically at four currency completely already. Nope, not at all. Only at one. I'm sure we'll get more. I mean, look at this. There are at least one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. There are at least ten to twelve upgrades. If I imagine that there's... An upgrade for the gun. 
and then there's an item that we don't have yet underneath that gun. That's probably gonna have an upgrade for it. And then there's obviously the little slots to the left, and the health. Oof. Hey! Another mage guy. Probably an enemy, aren't you? Okay, that's cute. Ow, that's not as cute! Excuse you? <laughs> what was that about? Trying to hit me with giant squares. That is very rude. Well, at the very least, it looks like I could just charge in and smack him down. Oh god, these things. That's what I gotta do! Ow. Heal! I have to use my gun sometimes! <laughs> because otherwise, they're gonna kill me from a distance. Also, I like how we announced that this area was finished. We just kind of flipped our sword around like, Ha! Yeah, we're awesome. We know. Hey, warp! Neat! So, that's a bad sign, by the way. That's a really bad sign. And the reason why it's a bad sign is because... That, that's practically telling us that we're probably gonna have to fight a boss here. Because of the sign for the boss. It's also letting us know that if this guy ends up being too hard for us, the game is totally encouraging us to back the fuck out. I mean, it's also good to have warp points, period. <laughs> But I feel like, uh, yeah. If this guy ends up being too hard, the guys would be like, Yeah, just go somewhere else for now, man. What is this? Oh, would you look at that? Okay, so we got one of these pieces. And that is... One of the pieces for... Okay, so... I was right in one of the assumptions I made when we were shown the diagram. So we have to get four pieces from each corner. And so we got one from this area. There's three more in this place. One, two, three, four. Ah. <laughs> so the, the night guy, our bestie, he told us the location of all four of them. Or the general location of all four of them. Which is good, which is good. Uh, and I'm guessing that we, in order to even access the boss, we're gonna need all four of those pieces. Because once we get all four pieces, maybe it makes the boss? I'm not really sure, I mean, we could just go all over the place. This is a learning kind of experience. I have to understand and learn the language of this world that I've never been a part of. Whoa, okay. I also have to understand this map, which just really doesn't jive well with everything I know about maps. Don't you do this to me. Okay, just making sure. <laughs> he looked like he was about to fucking laser me. Oh god, so now we're over here. This game is so confusing. Why can't they just make a normal fucking map? Okay, like, let me look at this map and demonstrate what I mean. I can't even, actually. I can't look at the above level, because we're just stuck down here. Fine, whatever, doesn't matter. We're gonna go beat a bunch of- We're gonna go die, and then beat a bunch of mages to death. Bad bird mages! Stop that! At least these guys are pretty easy to beat. Uh, yeah, no, yeah, that's what I figured. I was like, I wonder what these do. That was a... <laughs> I thought I was faster on the draw than that, but I am not. Oh god, I have to do it all over again. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. That's my own fault. I should try to do it a more normal way. This game would be far less confusing if the maps were just laid out better, so that way I could go, Oh, okay, that's what this does. Nope. 
we understand now. We don't want to be in the wrong place at the wrong time. Uh, so here's a convenient... Oh, no, nope, not so convenient. There's a break in the path, and there is something down there. But I can't get to it because we don't have a far enough dash ability yet. Uh, that middle one's gonna be safe. So it looks like the safest time to go is when that third one's falling. Oh, God, I almost fucked that up. <laughs> I almost really fucked that up. Oh, God, hello. What do you think you're doing, buddy? They have fucking turrets guarding the place now. And I can't damage them, as we saw from the shooting. See? Yeah, we're just gonna go. I hope. Oh my god. Okay. Killing all the enemies allows us to leave. I thought we were just gonna be locked there forever. Like, oh god, I didn't activate the switch for this particular place and now I'm doomed. Yeah, I'll heal. That's a big scary monster. Whoa! No! Hello, friend. I think not. <laughs> I... I don't appreciate that. So what does this do? It's locked, obviously. I'm so... Alright, so, apparently, at the very least, across our two worlds, we have a shared lock symbol. So thank you for that. Random world people who create logos. Okay, the developers of this game. I don't feel safe around these giant blocks. Like they're gonna smash into me. Jump! Smack the hell out of him, dash back! <laughs> Big guy, not so scary. Not yet. Watch them have like a ranged attack later on. I mean, technically, yeah, they already have a ranged attack. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Please don't bring your friends out when I saw you alone by yourself. You have to stay there, completely on your own. Oh! That's how you're gonna try and get me. That's dirty. Lock me in close range combat with the big guy who smacks me, smacks you around. Oh no, I was right! <laughs> I was looking at them like, I don't trust these giant blocks. And well, now they're activated. God. Okay, well this isn't so bad. I just have to like, not not fuck up. I have to do it all over again, don't I? Son of a bitch. I didn't dash in time. God damn it. We can handle this. Alright, so now we know. Now we know. I like how fucked up I got. Oh no. <laughs> At least enemies don't respawn. Yeah, that's how I feel about those guys. Quack! Ooh, you know what? It's actually even dirtier to be locked in with the ranged dudes like this. I don't care about the big guy, he's actually not too bad. I just dodge, and then smack, back off, ow, and dodge again. You know, minus the fucking up part. The range guys, on the other hand, <laughs> they can get you locked in, and that's not- that's when it's not so good. Alright. So when it's going back is when we run across, because that gives us some time. I can also obviously have to dash. This one's pretty fucking fast. And so you have to press A to get past it. Uh, now this is a scary one. So I have to wait until they're breaking apart and the other one's going across like this. Whew. And then I press A. It doesn't look hard. But me and like platforming games, we don't get along. 
That was my own fault. I don't even know why I walked into the path. I just- I was just gonna start talking about how me and platformer games, uh, and this is obviously like a full-on platformer or something, but... These kinds of puzzles, they fuck with me. <sighs> Dude. Alright. They fuck with my mind, because I have to like, map out everything in my head, and then go. So, it should be noted that you die on contact, I think. And so... <laughs> we're gonna try to avoid that. Beforehand, it felt like they was just squashing me, but that's just only a part of the act. That's the end of it. The beginning part is you dying as it makes contact with you at high speed. Alright, let's actually pay attention to this. So, there's a pattern here. It goes one, three, one, two, and then one, three, then two. One, two, then three, and then, okay. At some point, it sinks all of them. Shit. <laughs> and I, then my own impatience got me. Like, I started mapping it out, but I was like, Ah, you know what? I can probably just wing it. I shouldn't have winged it. I winged it. <laughs> I just said, at some point, one of these just ends up being still, and I can make it across then. Ah, oh boy. All right, all right, all right, all right. We have to go. We have to go at a particular moment. I think when the second one, the, or rather, yeah, when the middle one goes by itself, is the best moment for us to go. Like that. Fuck! Okay, so it's not the best moment for us to go. Uh, this is... This is rough. But you're gonna be here with me, right? You guys are gonna be here with me? We can suffer together? <laughs> Because at some point, I'll get it down. You know, from like, a YouTube perspective, this looks like it's probably super easy. You just go, oh yeah, man. Go on, look, man. It's one, two, and then one, two, one, three, four, five, and then one, two. Okay, all right, it's super easy. You just have to go at that particular moment. <laughs> Whack. Now this one is super easy. I just have to wait for it to go away, and then I go. Oh, come on. What is this shit, guy? At least these ones are not, like, changing it up. <laughs> At least these are just the same pattern. One, two, three. One, two, three. Shit, shit! Oh my god, okay, just spam A, man. Just spam A and you'll be fine. Oh, come on! Fuck, fuck, fuck! No! Please! Please tell me I don't have to do it all over again! Thank God! That was the part that was scaring me the most. <laughs> Fucking. I don't want to do this entire thing again just to fight these enemies. Okay, now that I know we're not gonna fucking horribly lose, this is gonna be easy peasy. I just need to calm myself, smack the enemies, shoot these enemies as they come in. Heal. Fuck me, these ones are annoying. Woo that would have been a lot of lasers to the face. Ah, oh, I'm going down. Unless I spam bullets. Ha 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 
I like how I threw my sword down in triumph, yet there was still one enemy left. Oh. Rooms are tough when they just decide, hey, you know what, here, have like 500 enemies coming your way. <laughs> like, look at all the corpses in this room. It is ridiculous. And this is our reward. One piece of four. And no medkit. That's our other reward. This is gonna be rough. See, it doesn't look like it, it ever fills your health back up. Uh, except for at like warp points. Give me a moment, I'm questioning things. <laughs> so obviously this leads all the way back here. Then we come back. But I wanted to like jump across the pillars. But anyways, what I was saying beforehand about uh, stuff not getting refilled. So in like Dark Souls 3, if you go to, or Dark Souls 3, if you go into like Dark Souls or Demon Souls or Bloodborne, anytime you go to a rest point, It fills up your health, and then it gives you your Essence Flasks, or your Blood Vials back. And that basically means you get all your heals back, and you don't have to worry about anything. But, in this game, it doesn't look like it's going to do that. In this game, it looks like it's just going to give me... Vials when I find them in the world, and then never refill them. And so that's... That's going to be rough. That's going to be rough going. Because it means... I'm not going to be able to heal up as much, and so I should be more mindful of that, I guess? Okay, I need three out of the four to get in that room. That probably leads to the fourth one. Good to know. And I need all four to go up there. I'm lost. <laughs> I'm lost because of what we were talking about beforehand about the map about how it's not really structured in any kind of decent way. Like, you can't see me really exploring some of this place. It It's kind of segmented in zones, but it doesn't show the segmentation of those zones. It just shows a map of the place, kind of. But so, like, if you look at the map, we're here. We're physically on this staircase on the right away from the temple but it's showing me in the middle with the warp pad because technically we're in the middle area the middle zone and that's fucking peculiar and it's throwing me for a loop trying to find myself around this place because <laughs> i'm like okay where the hell am i oh i'm over in the middle area wait a second <laughs> no i'm not Okay, from this place it looks like there's an ex exit to the left. Oh, wait. This place only has an exit at the top and the bottom. What? That is just a uh, weird, interesting map design. Have I been here? Okay, that's not a sheer drop. <laughs> this looks like a sheer drop, and then I could just make my way to the other side. And I definitely can, like this, but Jesus. More currency! Yay, we have a second golden ticket! Yay! I could head back to the city and buy something. In fact, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> Hold up, okay, how do I actually access... Oh, well, alright. Whoa. Alright, now we know how to navigate the, the underlayer and the upper layer maps a little bit. Even if it's still a bit... wonky confusing. See, on paper, this looks like it makes complete sense. The map itself isn't confusing. It's being in the map and then looking at the map. That's confusing. <laughs> I bet someone is gonna make a comment. Or probably already has, like, Oh man, Gob, I could never give you a map and have you drive us around a city. But fuck that, I know how to read road maps. I even know how to read topographical maps. And identify, oh yeah, well, this hill looks like it's the hill on this area of the map. Not getting in here. Okay. Let's see if we can find something that costs us two items. 
This guy sold the bombs, which could be helpful for those big groups of enemies. And he sold them for two items a pop? Those look like they would be very, very helpful. But... I'm not a big fan of consumables. So instead I could do other things. Oh god, is he gonna eventually have... Six slots worth of item upgrades? Great! So his upgrade's gonna be... Allowing us to fire more shots. Which is gonna allow us to take on more enemies with my ranged fire. I feel like this is gonna be a better bet because this recharges. But I want new abilities as well. So I'm gonna go for... I'm gonna go for the bomb. Because that's a two... that's a two cost item. Okay. And the next upgrade for this one is three tickets. That's fine, that's fine. I'm guessing that's gonna allow me to have an extra bomb. So now we have... If we look at my character thing, we have an extra thing at the bottom. Oh, it's not gonna be a second item. So I guess maybe eventually I'm gonna have like a second gun? Or maybe a different sword? I don't know. So it looks like the bomb has a regenerating cooldown time, which is nice, actually. So it's not gonna be a matter of like smacking objects and having you get filled back up. It's just waiting like 15 to 30 seconds and then you're good to go. We're gonna head back up now. Now if I'm fighting a giant room of enemies <laughs> and getting really annoyed with dealing with it, I can just go bomb attack and murder half of them. Or all of them. At least that recharges. Med kits don't. And that makes me sad because I have no idea how to get them. There might be a thing, it might be like uh, some other games where items will respawn in the environment if they are consumable. Uh, or like a needed consumable, like health bags. And so it might become like a point where we need to learn the location of all of the health- Ooh. All of the health packs to help us proceed further. <laughs> I could go on his hand on just a little bit. Not all the way, though. Hey, friend. Sorry to walk on your hand a little bit, but you're dead, so, I mean, it's not like you can really feel anything. Or maybe he's just going for a really long sleep. Well, that's just rude. <laughs> so if I leave... ...and then come back, will the item be respawned? More than likely, no. But it could be a thing of like, oh, if you go across two screens and then come back, it's different. And so I want to, I want to explore that because if I can grind health items off of one place over and over again, that would obviously be very good. I'm just going to go up the, uh, down this lift. Oh, wait. Well, I mean, we can go down this lift. But this is the area that we were at beforehand, which is how come I was like, haven't I been here before? <laughs> haven't I been in this direction? I have been in this general place, but not this entire area. I'm sure someone who's going to like... Who's beaten the game already is gonna come in the comments and be like, Go. Go. You silly Billy. <laughs> you silly little Billy Willy. I know everything there is about this world. It's language. I can understand all the hieroglyphics. And you're completely misunderstanding absolutely everything. The game told you all this stuff. You just need to be able to translate it. And actually, the language is very similar to the English language. Only 26 letters. Oh boy. Yeah, he's got a big gun. It's only got 26 letters, you just have to pay attention to the world. Okay. <laughs> well, we both suck, huh? Oh, we got rid of all those symbols and bills. <laughs> and then yeah, I could have pushed him to his death, I guess. How? What do these do? Oh, they just break, so I can shoot more shit. Pew, pew.
trying to aim my crosshair at an enemy on the other side of the room is a bit of a bitch. Oh. Those fall a lot faster than I thought they did. So is this a time kind of thing? No. Alright. Just making sure. I'm getting a little bit better at dodging <laughs> lasers. That makes me proud. That makes me happy. I mean, they obviously shouldn't be all too hard for me to dodge. Anyways? Because they're pretty, pretty well telegraphed. I mean, giant purple squares show up exactly where the attacks are going to hit. <gasps> oh, give me a health item from here. I guess there was a health box behind there, or that's just it just had a health thing inside of it. I don't know. Oh my. Big room, big room, lots of monsters. And as I go through this place... Ow. The land shifts. Fuck, this is a bitch. It's not like aiming a normal gun. Whoa! I missed my bomb. I'm sad! That was my first bomb and it didn't go anywhere near where I wanted it to. Oh well. Ow. Alright. Note to self. Smacking enemies a whole lot does not recharge your bombs any faster. This saddens me. This saddens me. It's legitimately a full-on cooldown kind of thing. Which is fine. I Means it's kind of a determined... Finality. Oh, here we go. I figured there was something over here. The environment kind of gave it away. But I didn't know exactly how. 